YouTube and welcome to yet another beer review with me, Peter, the master of hobbits. Hobbits? <laughs> that sounded strange. Uh, as you see, I've gotten a haircut. My hair is a whole lot shorter now. Even though I sort of wanted to keep the long hair, but whatever. Uh, it's just hair, right? Um, today's beer is going to be yet another Canadian beer from the Unibrew, Unibrew Brewery. It is going to be the Unibrew Dun Didier. It's a Belgian strong ale on 9% alcohol by volume, and I really like the label on this one. It's na it, Don de Dieu means gift of God. I think it's called Don de Dieu. But it, it means gift of God, uh, and it's named after the ship of some French explorer who went to America, the Cana uh, North America. He's come something with... Champlain or something like that. that's his last name. I'm not quite sure. I can't really remember. Nine percent, thirty-three centiliter bottle or eleven point five ounces, I think. A smooth, rich wheat beer filled with delicate notes of fruit and spice, followed by a crisp, dry finish. Uh, it's brewed with water, barley malt, wheat malt, sugar, wheat spices, hop, and yeast. Quite interesting that it's a Belgian strong ale brewed with wheat. But let's check it out. Whoa! Who's like? I could just feel the carbonation shooting up my my wrist, my hand. That was quite strange. Got to use the official Unibrew snifter, and let's get it on. Oh, that looks delicious. Haven't had a Belgian strong ale in quite some time, so this is going to be nice. Hopefully. Oh, look at that color. That's... That's basically a traditional Belgian strong ale color, uh, like that dark, uh, slightly dark orange. Uh, this is quite pale, and that's a huge amount of carbonation. Don't know if you can see that, guys, but really, like a sick amount of carbonation on there. And the head is like a big, four-finger frothy head. Uh, it's bright white. It looks quite nice, actually. Uh, this looks like an, uh, a good beer. It's slightly hazy as well, but let's give, check out the aroma. Oh yeah, some fruits in here. It has like a champagne-like quality to it. Oh, there's a ton of spices in here, and a ton of yeast as well, and a breadiness. It smells like banana. Mmm, smells really nice actually. Uh, tons of fruits, uh, some banana, it's a lot of spices actually, especially clove and the yeast. You can read like a fruity, the fruity esters is there as well from the yeast, uh, along with um, some nice spice. It's quite doughy actually. That's also nice, but let's give it a taste. It smells really good. Oh man, that is that is delicious. Ooh. And it's real darn smooth for a 9% beer. Um, the body is medium and uh, slightly dry with a ton amount of carbonation tickling your taste buds. Oh yeah, man, this is good stuff. Um it's really, really fruity. Really fruity. Get some vanilla as well um, in the flavor. Along with that, that's, there's also the, the banana and um, some, some spice. Spice is definitely the clove I get, but I also get like a peppery flavor as well. Oh, there's a huge amount of fruity esters in here. That is really, really nice beer, guys, actually. So far, this is the best I've had from, from Unibrew. Uh, it's also quite doughy. Quite, uh, wow, look at the color transformation with the yeast in. That's all, now, now it's like darker orange, but let's check it out with the yeast. Basically the same, just way, uh, a bit more doughy, I think. And slightly bready as well. You can definitely taste the wheat malts used, which is quite nice. 
the, the flavor of banana is sort of like in a Hefeweizen, which is quite strange. It's, it's, this is really good. Maybe apple as, as well. Uh, yeah, S a slight amount of apple, I think. But the banana is definitely there. That's nice. That's like a clean flavor of banana. I wouldn't call it crisp, but it's definitely slightly dry. They, they called it crisp on the bottle, but this is a good beer, guys. Um, definitely worth checking out if you get Unibrew. Uh, yeah, rating-wise, it's getting a 90. This is a superb Belgian Strong Ale from Canada. Definitely a beer you should seek out or check out. So, yeah, a 90. 90 for the Unibrew done, did you? A superb Belgian Strong Ale brewed with uh, wheat malt. Hope you guys can find it. And uh, that's it for this beer review, guys. Comment on my video this video and check out my other videos subscribe on the button on the corner there what else thumbs up thumbs up yeah yeah and uh, that's about it and I'm gonna say cheers and I'll see you guys in the next beer review